I mean, I've never done something where the main love story is a friendship. Um, and I think they always kind of get a, a, like the backseat treatment um, for uh, a romantic relationship being front and center. But I think it makes you realize that there is so much romance and friendships. And especially being in your early twenties, your longest relationships have been with your friends. And so it's so nice to kind of um, just, you know, uh, pay attention to that and pay respect to it. Yeah. Um, Emma, Maggie watching Birdie slowly grow distant is so heartbreaking, um, especially in those quiet moments where you can just see it in her face that she's recognizing it. Um, was that sort of difficult for you to depict, like, emotionally? Mm, that's a really good question. Um, I don't think it was difficult. I think it was trying to find the right gauge um, of where she is kind of, like, in each episode. And I, what I had to get into my head as well is that you see one side of Maggie, which is like the slightly performative, how she wants everyone to see her. And then the audience also gets to see what's going on in her head. Um, so kind of creating the difference between that where you're seeing her trying to be fine and everything's okay and I wanna be happy for my friend. And then also seeing her starting to feel lost and, um, you know, sad, but also wanting to be happy for her friends. So you're starting to see kind of like that complexity. So. Yeah, I was just kind of trying to figure out the, the nuances of that. 